Hey, welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to have a little app review. A uh, cute app if you want to uh, learn to play the piano and can't afford to have one, well there's a free app that's going to help you play the piano. Uh, it is nice and it actually works both on touch devices and even if you don't have a touch device, it actually works with the keyboard also. So go to your Microsoft Store and search on the search for apps Piano 8 that you see here. Once you have Piano 8, you will see this free app. Um, all you have to do is click the install button and behold, once it's installed, you'll have a Piano app. So here it is, Piano 8. And you have, of course, ads and all sorts of stuff. You can remove the ads if you want by paying, but it's not, uh, it still works even if you don't, uh, you know, pay. So play with your touchscreen, mouse, or keyboard, as it says here. So you click play with Piano 8. And if you use your mouse, you can click the keys. Now you probably don't hear the piano, but I hear it here in my uh, headphones. You can also play on the screen if you have a touch screen. You can play directly on a tablet, for example. And if you have a big tablet, it's almost uh, the size of a piano uh, keyboard. Uh, on a touch device, the only problem, because I have one on my um, iPhone, for example, an iPad, is the fact that you don't have the feel of the, you know, keys on the piano itself, which is also something very important, I must say. But you can still play, or you can play on your keyboard. You see that each key has a letter attached to it. So if you press the, the keys on your keyboard that are matched there, that you can actually play. So, um, keyboard, mouse, and touchscreen play, which is nice. It's enabled for everything. Uh, what's missing? Well, the feel that if you don't, for example, on the keys, if you just press a little bit, you know, it will be soft in the sounds. And if you press harder, it will be, uh, you know, louder and increased sound. These are art effects to actually make but these are missing because on a piano it's nice to be able to soften the notes sometimes but still you know if you want to just play around and learn a little bit of piano why not try it and to help you you also have uh, the musical notes written on the keys white and black keys and you can go an, oct an octave up or down so if it's too high, you can actually change and change octave, which means that it's higher. So uh, it's a nice little app, actually, for free. Why not uh, download it and try it and uh, see if uh, you can become a great musician? With start uh, with Piano 8. Piano 8, nice free app on. The Microsoft Store. Why not go and get it? If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, let us uh, know. Maybe you have an app or you have something you'd like us to talk about. Um, maybe a problem with Windows 8 that we can make a video and help others at the same time. Uh, we'll try to post a video if possible. Uh, it's not possible to answer every little uh, detail because I get hundreds and hundreds of mail and comments of all sorts on the channel every day. I can't answer everyone, but I try to answer if possible. So thank you for watching and hope to see you soon on the official Windows 8. Bye-bye.